walk me through this. When you guys say, hey, Kobe, we got a new shoe coming up for you. We want your input. Do you, does, does Kobe like fly in? You're sitting around a table. You got designers pitching him options. To walk me through and people behind the scenes, like how uh, a LeBron or a Kobe will design a certain shoe. Like how's, what's the start to finish on that? It, it can be a little bit of all that. And I think it varies by the athlete. Um, you know, Kobe had, Kobe worked for the majority of his time with Nike. He worked really through one designer named Eric Avar. Okay. And they just had an incredible uh, kinship. Um, both pinnacle performance people, both worldly visionary. Um, you know, he, he, was, he was a different level from an insight perspective. Um, you know, one of the, probably the things that's maybe noteworthy is, is we made a shift. Uh, we sort of reintroduced low top basketball shoes. Right. Um, you know, Steve Nash was kind of flirting with it a little bit, but Kobe was really the one 2009 ish that really kind of took for about, I don't know, a five to seven year run really just brought that to light. And, and, you know, he, he, you know, he grew up in it's documented. He grew up in Italy as a kid. For about eight years, he spoke fluent uh, Italian and, you know, may he rest in peace. I mean, just an incredible man. And, and it's just very sad for, for the world at large. Um, and he just was he was all into like, I want to feel uh, I want to feel surfaces. I want to be so low to the ground. I want to feel surfaces. And, you know, really the strength of your body really starts with your feet. Mm -hmm. And, you know, if you control the heel, you control the foot. And by really designing sort of a contoured low pep basketball shoe, you could eliminate all this upper material in the shoe. A lot of that is just proprioceptive anyways. If you're going to really twist your ankle, your brace or your tape, that's not even going to work. It's, it's really about the strength of, of really your joints and your ligaments. And by really building something from the bottom up with him, you got to a whole new sort of form of, or, uh, of design and, and just that's the kind of stuff he could lead you to. Um, he just very, very insightful. So that was that was an amazing experience um, to work uh, with that. And since then, that team, uh, I left that in, in the, you know, 2009, 2010, that team has sort of taken it to a whole different level. Mm -hmm. in the football game. So it's fun to see.